Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can see, this is a packing video. I had a ton of requests for me to do a packing video after I shared my Dallas uh, conference vlog. Um, I shared a little sneak peek of how I pack and so many of you guys asked for me to do a packing video. You guys know I am really, really big into organization and it really doesn't have to stop at home. Packing is really all about organization. I have traveled a ton for business and that's just something that I did before we adopted the boys, before we started the adoption process, the company that I worked for then. Um, I used to travel two weeks out of the month. I am gonna show you guys a technique that I've done for years and years. Um, I have stepped up my game with the products that I'm using, which I will show you guys in a minute and you guys already saw a sneak peek in that Dallas vlog. But um, I do have a carry-on luggage piece here. This um, luggage piece does come in two different sizes. I only own the carry-on size, but I do plan on buying the check size eventually. I love this piece. Yes, I have it in white. It holds up very well. You can just kind of clean this with like a little magic eraser. It cleans up perfectly. I've had a lot of people ask. However, if you are afraid of the white, it comes in navy, it comes in black, it comes in green. It comes in a ton of different colors and you still get this beautiful like leather accent and then of course you have your personal item and I almost always take my Neverfull GM just because of its size but then also its practicality to use as a handbag while you were on your trip. So whether you are road tripping or you are flying by plane, I have made this work for either trip, it doesn't matter. Um, we don't do a lot of plane flying together as a family just because we have all the dogs. We really like to travel with them. So we do do a lot of like weekend traveling or long weekends. And this is how I pack not only for those long weekend trips or weekend trips, but also for business travel and things like that. So let's go ahead and get started. So here is the luggage piece. I just wanted to show you guys a full view of it, but let's go ahead and open her up. So as you can see, everything is put away and in its spot. Everything has a spot, which I love. You guys know this is really my organization style. I like for everything to have a spot. I do want to start over on this side, and this is where you're going to see like my packing technique. But before we do that, I want to show you guys how much extra space that you have. So if you're packing for fall, if you're packing for winter, you can definitely roll up a lightweight jacket. You can roll up some sweaters, cardigans, whatever it is, or anything else that you pack that maybe you would need for a trip. Here is plenty of room here. Um, let me go ahead and open this up and I do want to show you guys these are the pouches that started it all. Um, so I shared these this this size in my Dallas vlog. So these are the nudie tan from OTG 24-7 or on the go 24-7. That is basically their entire concept. They really want functional, easy, on-the-go pieces that really coordinate all together. Um, this is the nudie. The nudie stands for the clear on one side and the tan is the color. Um, so some of their pouches do offer this nudie selection, which I love, especially for this particular size because you can see everything that's in here. So I do utilize this particular size, the size 10, for two different reasons. The main reason that I utilize it is for this reason, but like I said, there are a ton of different ways to use it. So I have one, two, three, four, five shirts in here and then one dress and then underneath that I have another pouch number 10 in the nudie tan and I have one two three pair of shorts and two pair of jeans so between these two pouches I have six full outfits but what's great about these pouches is they are waterproof so at the end of my trip whenever I've worn all my outfits I actually end up reusing these and they basically end up being used as like dirty clothes hampers because they're waterproof when I get home I can take out all my clothes put them in the dirty clothes and I can you can actually hose these off I usually just spray a little bit in there or use a wipey or something like that and disinfect the inside to get the inside clean again but you can definitely utilize these for a ton of different reasons because they are waterproof so think about your beach trips you know your beach vacations and stuff like that you can definitely use those for those but let me go ahead and move over to this side on this side you can see that I do have a little mesh compartment and in the mesh compartment I have two more of my OTG pouches um, you guys know that I do have the niece BB but whenever I am traveling light that one isn't the most um, you know, that wasn't, it isn't the most compact piece. So I do love to use these again because they are waterproof. I don't have to worry about them. These are also from OTG and these are the size four. Also in the nudie tan, they're clear in the front. 
and then the tan color in the back. Um, there are a ton of different colors and stuff with this one. You can see this one I have is shampoo, conditioner, body wash, face scrub, toothbrush, toothpaste. So this is basically all my wet stuff. So I could take this to the bathroom, put it by the shower. Or I could either brush my teeth in the shower or I can brush my teeth by the sink, but this is all my wet stuff. And then this is all like my drier stuff. So I have my deodorant, my dry shampoo, my comb, uh, my hair serum, some hair ties, some facial wipes, a solid perfume. Everything here is more of like my dry stuff. I like to just kind of separate things like that. But here's all of your like toiletries and stuff. Not everything, but this is a lot of your toiletries. You'll see more of my toiletries in just a bit. And then once I open up this side, you are going to see a ton of stuff and still extra room. So let me open her up and you can see. So the first thing that you see is another OTG pouch. And this one is in the size 5. This one is not a nudie, so this one's just a tan number 5. What I love about this pouch is I know sometimes, depending on where you're traveling, I personally don't like to go out and about in the city with a designer piece. You could actually utilize this as a day clutch or an evening night clutch after you're using it for storage. So I'm going to show you guys what I have in here. Um, I have an extra pair of sunglasses, so obviously I'm going to have whatever sunglasses that I'm wearing that particular day. Um, I have a thing of wipies. You guys know I'm really big into water wipes. So these are good to have when you're traveling to wipe down surfaces or whatnot or for the boy's hands. And then I also have some extra jewelry here. So this is an extra watch, some extra bracelets. You can see I have so much more room for more, but whenever I'm traveling light, I try to take uh, you know as little as possible. But all of the interiors match. They all coordinate very well. Let me move this stuff over. And then I also have a full-size blow dryer. I don't care where I'm going. I want my blow dryer. I know the hotels offer a blow dryer, but I like to take my own blow dryer. And I also like to take my own flattener just because I, you know, they don't have those in the hotels, but I always take my flattener as well. And then I do have another piece here for my jewelry. Um, I love this piece. It's great because it is hard and solid. So a lot of my pieces, I feel, you know, I feel confident putting them in here. I don't have to worry about them. You can see I have a lot of earrings and stuff like that in here. And then I have extra dainty necklaces and dainty jewelry here in just individual pouches. But like I said, because this is a solid piece, Piece, I do feel comfortable with it. I don't have to worry about anything getting smushed or anything like that. And then the last pieces I have in the carry-on are two more pouches. The first pouch is a nudie tan number eight. You can see that lining is the exact same. It's the nudie on the front and the tan on the back. And this is the number eight size. So in here I actually have seven or eight pair of underwear. I have an extra bra. I have a bralette and I have two pair of pajamas. So again, this is going to last you all week long wherever you're going, but you can see there is plenty of room in here for more. And then the very last pouch that I have is this one and it has four pair of shoes. So I have a pair of sandals, another pair of sandals, a pair of flats and another pair of sandals. So we are packing for a summer trip, but like you can see, I've got a pair of flats in here. I can definitely put in some flats in here if I wanted to, but just in the summertime, I do wear a lot of flats and a lot of sandals. So I have four pair of shoes, guys, plus keep in mind whatever pair of shoes you are wearing when you are traveling. So that is everything in this carry-on. I wanna show it to you empty just so you can see what it looks like empty. That is everything in this carry-on. Everything was very well packed, very well compact, and you had plenty of room, but let's go ahead and move on to the personal item. Okay, now here is my personal item and you can see I really do prefer to take the Neverfull GM just because of its size but also it's practicality to use as a handbag once you are there. And obviously the first thing on top is my travel blanket. I love this travel blanket. Obviously this is completely optional, but I really like to be comfortable whenever I'm road tripping, but also I like to be comfortable in the airplane. So I love taking this particular blanket with me. It is definitely a splurge, but I love it. And I highly recommend it. If you are looking for something for travel, it makes a great gift as well for a the traveler in your life. But I love that. But again, of course, this is definitely optional. Optional. So once you take the blanket off, you can see now I have my, you know, my carry-on. This is basically my handbag, but it also has some extra travel pieces. So the very first thing that I have in here is my pochette Matisse. So I love the pochette Matisse whenever I'm traveling. So if I'm going out and about sightseeing whatever it is throughout the day, running errands, whatever it is that I'm doing throughout the day, the pochette Matisse is one of my favorite bags. Um, this is also assuming you're in a place where you feel comfortable 
comfortable carrying a designer bag. You can definitely throw in a different bag in here or like I said, you can use the pouch that I showed you guys in the luggage piece, the number five size. Um, but I do like taking an extra bag with me wherever I go. So I will have a tote bag option, but then I also have like a crossbody option. Now there's nothing in here except the extra strap and stuff like that, but I wanted to show you guys because I definitely would take an extra bag with me wherever I was going. And then after that, you can see I basically just have my SLGs and one extra pouch. I'll go into the extra pouch in just a second, but the first pouch I want to show you guys is my Toiletry 26. Um, what I basically utilize this for is makeup and some skincare. Now when I'm traveling, I do not take everything skincare wise. I take the must. So you can see I have some um, night cream in here. I have my eyeshadow palette. You can see I have all my, you know, my makeup and everything is all in here. I'm not going to go into that, but basically this entire pouch is filled up with my makeup and some skincare items, really everything that I need. And this is again, the toiletry 26. Um, and then of course the next thing that I have is my wallet. This is my full size zippy wallet. Again, I'm not going to go into everything. This is just a handbag essential. And then of course I have my sunglass case and then you guys saw that I did have an extra pair of sunglasses in the luggage but then I also have the sunglasses that I'm wearing for that particular day. So basically I have two pair of sunglasses for this trip. And then of course you cannot go anywhere without your key. So then of course I have my six ring key holder. And then the very last pouch that I have is my very last pouch from OTG um, 24 seven. And this is a number two size. And I honestly just really fell in love with this kitty design for a couple of reasons. You guys know I do have a lot of mono stuff. This is what I primarily use. I love the idea of whenever I'm traveling, whenever I open up this pouch, you could see it's a sea of monogram, Louis Vuitton monogram. I like the idea of getting something a little fun and different. So if you were looking for just essentials, you're not like, oh, which Louis Vuitton bag is it? And I just fell in love with this one. So for this one, I just put a lip gloss, my chapstick, just kind of like my must have things. If you're traveling, on the airplane you could make you could get like something like this and put your um, maybe even like a different size and put with like a fun print and put your travel papers in it or whatever it is um, but there are a lot of different uses for this one but I just really fell in love with the kitty cat design I don't know why it just reminds me of Lexi doesn't it look like Lexi I just think it looks like Lexi I think it's super cute and then um, the only other thing that I would have in here and I've had it sitting next to me is my cell phone and that is it and I most likely would have that in this pocket but that is everything that would be in my personal item as well as my carry-on so that is everything guys that is how I packed these two pieces for a basically a week-long trip whether it's a road trip plane trip whatever it is you really can pack a ton in these two pieces um, I do want to make sure to let you guys know I do have a coupon code for OTG 24 7 I really do love their pieces the way that the relationship with them and how I got the, the coupon code was actually because of you guys I shared those pouches in the Dallas vlog video and OTG actually got on the video, saw the comments of you guys requesting a code, asking if I had one, talking about the pouches, you wanted more information. They emailed me and they were like, hey, why don't we give your viewers a coupon code? And I just thought that was perfect. So I know that a lot of you guys have already purchased the pouches. I wanted to show you guys a way to utilize them. There are a ton of different sizes other than the ones that I showed you guys in the Dallas vlog, but they have, I believe, 10 different sizes. 10 is the largest, one is the smallest. I have two, five, four, eight, and 10, and I love them. They really are great. I do plan on getting more in the future, but um, if you're looking for things and ways to organize your handbags, organize your luggage, whatever it is, organize your kids, school bags, uh, gym bags, whatever it is, check them out. I'll put the link to their website below as well as the coupon code. I believe it's 15% off, which is an amazing deal. Um, you can get quite a bit to organize your entire family for whatever it is you're needing. But I hope you guys have a great day, week. I'm so glad that you guys, um, you know, really requested this video. It was fun. You guys know I love to organize. So I love showing different ways to organize. And this was just something a little bit different that I would typically think of but I know you guys wanted it so I wanted to do it for you guys so I hope you guys enjoyed make sure to hit that subscribe button notification button get this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I will see you guys in my next video talk to you soon Bye -bye. I hear you breathe but I can't see if you're right here next to me something's wrong wasn't it fun is it now we're done